Hello everyone, welcome to my balcony garden. I hope you're all well and enjoying the cooler weather that we've been having now that it's October. I love autumn, it's my favorite season. So today's video is my top six autumn gardening jobs that we can all be cracking on with because although summer is over, there's still lots going on in the garden, even in my small balcony garden. So let's get started. Number one. Harvest your produce. The days are getting shorter and colder, so make sure you harvest all your goodies before they go over, so things like tomatoes, peppers, they're not really gonna grow much anymore. Also the last of your herbs. And if you grow things like potatoes, dig them up because the slugs are gonna get them if you don't. Number two, collect seeds. Oh, I just love collecting seeds from my plants. It's like my plants that I've grown from seed have come full circle and now have produced their own seeds and I feel like a really proud mum. It's also a really lovely way to get to know your plants better by seeing them at all stages of their growth and then utilising all that they have to offer us. Depending on the plant you can then sow your seeds directly for the next year so things like nasturtiums or wildflowers or calendulas. If you sow them now, it's going to give them a really good start for the new year. But if you don't sow your seeds, make sure that you wash them and you dry them fully and store them in either a sterilised jar or a little packet. Remember to label them so you know which seeds are which and then store them in a cool, dry, dark space. Number three, plant your spring bulbs. We plant bulbs in autumn and winter because they need a period of time in the soil where they can experience lower temperatures. Otherwise, they're not going to flower. And this process is called vernalization. In my experience, I've generally found that the earlier I plant my bulbs in autumn, the earlier they emerge in spring. But you do have up until December to plant your bulbs. Number four, give your garden a good scrub. It is time to clean. It's boring, I know. I'm not a fan of cleaning myself, but if you give your garden, things like your pots, your tools, greenhouses, supports, all your growing spaces, give them a really good deep clean. This is going to greatly reduce any pests and diseases that may have been lingering around. Remember to also remove any dead plant material as well. Number five, bring your plants inside. It's getting too cold for many plants now, so bring things like your tender perennials inside, tender bulbs as well like gladioli and calla lilies, peppers, other annual herbs that are still on the go. And lastly, number six, review your season. So when I've done all my jobs, I like to sit down with a cup of tea and go through everything I grew this year, figure out what worked for me and what didn't, what I can improve on and what I want to grow next year. So for example, I realised that I can grow so many different plants on my balcony. I've got a 3.5 metre by 2 metre balcony, a city balcony. It's very small, but I can grow so many things. And this year I have grown so many things. Things like tomatoes, aubergines, coriander, charred chives. I've also learned how important full sun is for aubergines and how hand pollinating the flowers can really, really give you a bumper crop. I made a video about that, so I'll link them above. But it's all experience, it's all going into my brain, it's improving my skills as a gardener, and I loved every minute of it. So there you have it, they were my six top autumn gardening jobs. There are actually a lot of other things we can be getting on with, so things like collecting leaf mould, taking cuttings from plants like lavender and rosemary and geraniums for next year. You can also plant perennials for next year while the soil is still warm. And if you have vegetable patches and they're now fallow since you've harvested everything, hopefully number one point, um, you can start planting green manure, which is going to add and retain really important nutrients. I hope you enjoyed the video. Comment down below any jobs that you do around this time of year. Enjoy your gardens and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye. Mm -hmm.